Ever look at something in the real world and thought, I wish I could bring this into the digital world, like drop it right into the metaverse? That's exactly what a 3D scanner does. Hey guys, I'm Mia from Shining 3D, and today we're kicking off the very first episode of 3D Scan 101. A 3D scanner doesn't just see what something looks like, it accurately captures the whole shape, size, curves, and structure. Kind of like taking a photo, but with depths. And instead of a flat image, we can get a full 3D version, a complete digital copy we can view, span, or even 3D print. A 3D scanner doesn't just snap a photo. It actually project lights onto the surface, could be laser lines, shift patterns, or tiny dots. Then it watches how the light bounces back, picking up every curve, dent, and angle. It's like scanning the object with the beam of light, and every spot it touches gets turned into data. So how does that light become a digital object? As the scanner moves around, it collects thousands, sometimes millions of tiny points floating in the space. These points together make what we call a point cloud. Think of it like 3D pixels hanging in the air. The software then connects the dots, fills in the gap, and turns that cloud into a solid, detailed 3D model. So why scan in 3D? The uses are everywhere. In car customization, it helps recreate old parts and design custom upgrades inside and out. In manufacturing, 3D scanning helps catch tiny errors early on, making sure every part meets quality standards before assembly. Museums digitally preserve and restore ancient artifacts and can be used for online display. Healthcare uses it to design custom prosthetics, and it can also help with surgical guides. It also helps create things like baby helmets for head shape correction. And don't forget 3D printing. Once we have a digital model from 3D scanning, we can print out a physical copy. So now you know 3D scanners connect the physical and digital worlds. But here's the thing, not all 3D scanners work the same way. Next time, we'll explore how different types of light power 3D scanning in unique ways. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.